drop the puck tonight. The Ducks get off to a good start as they win the opening faceoff. Anaheim's on the attack. Here's a chance! And he can't find the net! Oh, and I like everything about this play until the finish, James. It's all about creating. That's exactly what happens. And then the puck is looking a little fine as it makes its way towards the net. And it misses. And he takes a shot! Denies him again! Moves the puck. Solid check to slow him down. Here's a short pass to Kerfoot. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Great cross ice pass. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Quick feed to Kerfoot. Takes the feed, but under pressure. Petrano's last play was a tough one, James. He loses his balance, which makes it difficult for him to corral the puck and get it off with precision, but he makes the play. Handles the pass. Arizona's got the puck along the wall. The Coyotes gain possession. Tries to get the puck over to Petrano. Moves it to McTavish. Arizona's got the puck. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Stetcher. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Oh, that save! Tremendous agility there by Gibson. Anaheim's got it in their own zone. Swap up. The Coyotes get a hold of the puck along the boards. And that pass attempt is deflected. Grabbed along the board by Leah Bushkin. Quick pass to Leeson. Arizona's got the puck inside the defensive zone. And now he moves it quickly to Sanford. Oh, making his presence felt with a hit. You want to send a message to your opponent early in the game, and that early delivery of a bone-crushing hit, that does just that. The Ducks scoop it up along the boards. Works it across to Jones. Anaheim's got it along the wall. Puts it on net. Oh, and he missed the net. What a chance there. Oh, James, when you're in the funnel, you've got that great scoring chance. you got to execute. You can't miss from that area. Anaheim's looking to break out. Moves it quickly over to Carrick. Denies him! Here's a short pass to O'Brien. Retreats with the puck inside the defensive zone. Steps inside the attacking zone, down the left wing. Fires it on net. Stopped by the goaltender, getting a piece of that one. Quick feed to Silverberg. At set of ice now, he grabs Great the puck. Up. Passes out front, and that chance is blocked. Arizona's moving the puck through set of ice. Moves it to Dumba. The Ducks have it now. Scooped up along the wall by Dumba. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Scores! I love that he fights to get tight to the net here, and it's all about accuracy and a quick release. It's not about how hard it is, and he doesn't miss. The Coyotes are on the board here, and they have the game's first goal in the back half of period number one. Well, you can really see that they bought into what the coach said pregame, James, about being patient, trying to capitalize on their opportunities, and they do it late in the opening frame. And now it's grabbed by Vakaninen. Looks like he's playing a little more confidence tonight, and he's looking for his first NHL goal. He's possessing the puck, and he's driving lanes. He's bound to get one. Arizona's up here in the first, and they could easily be up by more based on what they've done offensively. Kerfoot's won the draw here in their own zone. And he slides it quickly to Keller. The Coyotes played along the boards. Oh, what a save in front! And he takes the dish. And he comes up with it. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Just here in the late stages of this frame, we've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. The Ducks win the draw. 
Slides the pass over to Terry. The Ducks take it across the blue line. Great reach with the poke check by Velimaki. Oh, there's a great stop by Ingram. I love the way that he battles and competes with his puck, James. I mean, he loses it for a second, then he finds it, and he makes the save. Arizona's got it in their own zone. Bug stabs, gaining momentum. Great heads up play with the stick by Bakaninen. The Coyotes take over on possession. Drives to the sweet spot. Taken along the wall by Kraus. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. McTavish is taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. And there's the whistle stopping the play. For the one goal lead, there's a small margin of error, James, and to protect it, it can't be in the box. Now they're short-handed, and they gotta find a way to kill it off. Man advantage unit is set. Well, a timely power play at this juncture of the game, James, to even it up. This is huge for this power play for big stars. They need to shine. Nearing the final 60 seconds here this first period. play by the tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. Shot! Oh, what a fun save by Ingram! O'Brien's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. With the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Anaheim's got the puck against the half wall. Ingram's got the puck and he's gonna hang on. Just moments away from the resumption of this power play, they're ready to drop the puck here for this faceoff. Arizona's got a hold of the puck. The Coyotes will play it in their own end. And down he goes as the puck goes free. All right, there's the end of period number one. We'll take a breather, I'll recharge. The players will too. And we're coming back with period number two right after this. Welcome back everybody, James Sabalski with you. Period number two, the middle frame ready to go. Run the opening face off as their power play continues. Here we go, pucks in deep. The Ducks will play it from the defensive zone. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. The Coyotes have it against the wall. Moves the puck from off the bank pass. That stretch pass is a beauty, James. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. And the power play unit comes up empty on that one. Well, often in hockey, we say timing is everything. And when you're down by a goal and you have an opportunity on the power play, you have to cash in. And the whole bench knows that that was a missed opportunity. The Coyotes gain control of the puck. Poked away at center by Drysdale. Slides the puck over. And that pass is redirected. Great defensive effort with the stick. Directed over to Kerfoot. The Coyotes cross the line and gain the zone. And he's knocked off the puck there. Oh, gets a tripper on that one as he just got enough of it. The Coyotes lead this one early in the second period. They have certainly had a lot of jump offensively tonight. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Picked up along the boards by Henrique. Puck scooped up by Vakaninen. Takes the feed. Knocked away by Fowler. The Coyotes gain control of the puck against the wall. Anaheim's got control of it now from their own end. Pokes the puck away. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Levels him with the hit. 
Anaheim's looking to break out of their own end. Quick pass to Henrique. Through center along the wing. Gets a hold of the puck here in his own end. Moves it quickly over to Kraus. Across the line and on the attack. Into the offensive zone. A chance in front. And that's stopped. Kraus plays it now. Here's a short pass to Michelli. Right up Main Street and on the attack. Quick feed to Kalorn. Broken up by Dermott. Now over to Zucker. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Quick feed to Zucker. Denies the chance by blocking it. Puts it on goal. Here's a shot. And he catches that one with the glove. The Coyotes continue to lead it here in the second period. They have been very active in the offensive zone tonight. Arizona's won it, now they'll go on the attack. Let's see what the officials are calling. Well, that's certainly not gonna help the team. I mean, they're losing by one. They gotta find a way to get some momentum to get on the board. Now they find themselves killing a penalty. We know this penalty kill unit is ranked towards the bottom of the league, but they've got a chance here, a real great opportunity to turn things around. So let's see what can happen. The Coyotes will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Here's a chance, and that goes off a body. Gibson's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. Strong's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. The Ducks win it in the defensive zone. Looking to get it out, and the puck clears the zone. That's why you want players with active sticks on your PK, James. They can close quickly, and they can corral the puck and just fire it down the ice. From the right side, they gain the zone. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Pushes it across to Michelli. Handles the pass in the middle. Tries to the paint. Takes control of the puck. And that's off the glove and will play on! Kerfoot's ready to take the draw here on this power play. Anaheim's won the draw. Trying to clear the puck from his own end. Oh, and a nice job getting the puck out of the zone. Uh, first, you gotta get it. The PK unit does a great job reading where that puck is going to be able to retrieve it. And then you gotta get it down the ice, recognizing the glass is the best option. Perfectly executed. Terry's almost ready to get back on the ice. The Coyotes run out of time on the man advantage. Both sides back to even strength. That's a great job by the PK to have the ability to be aggressive and strong on the puck. Can't hang on to the puck after taking a knock. Passes over to Fowler. Skates across the blue line. Shot! Makes the save. Arizona's gained possession along the boards. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. The Ducks take it along the wall. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Ingram's gonna hang on to the puck for a whistle. More than half the period has expired. one nothing to score. And they take possession here in the offensive zone and time to go on the attack. Goaltender covers up and will get a faceoff. Both teams are set, we'll drop the puck here. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Poked away in the offensive end. Picked up along the wall by Kerfoot. Anaheim's got control of the puck. Takes a shot, and that goes off the face of the goaltender. The Coyotes gain possession along the wall. 
Arizona's got the puck in the defensive end. Taken by Fowler. Now a quick pass to Vakaninen. The Ducks played along the wing. Arizona's got the puck in their own end. Sanford's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. Let's get the official decision. Well, when you're looking for a goal, being shorthanded is not ideal. You're also killing valuable time where you can be pressing when you're PK. Guys, we know this PK unit is ranked toward the bottom of the league, but what they displayed so far tonight, killing off that first penalty, and hopefully they can capitalize on some more of that opportunity here. The Coyotes win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Wow, what a stop by Gibson. Jostles for the puck, but still hangs on. Sends it ahead to Bugstad. The Coyotes looking against the half wall. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Grabbed along the board by Leeson. Moves it to Carrick. That's the one-timer! Up along the wing. The Coyotes will play it against the boards. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? But Toronto's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Anaheim's won the faceoff deep in their own end. And they managed to clear it. Slip feed. Gains the zone from the right side. Skates to the crease. Just an easy pass save made by Gibson. The Ducks move the puck in the defensive zone. Time's up for the power play. Both teams back to equal strength. Well, the power play unit looks stifled out there, and they have to make adjustments and read off what the PK unit is doing, and there was none of that. And he slides it quickly to Henrique. And now he moves it to McTavish. Here's a shot! Oh, that's a buzzer of big save! And with that, two periods now in the books. Been a great night of hockey here on EA Sports, and we got the third period coming at you in moments. Both teams seem fresh after that second intermission. We're ready to drop the puck on period number three. They have dropped the puck here in the third. Got uh, two periods down. Here we go with the third period. Cheryl, your assessment so far. The Ducks really haven't played well for 40 minutes of play, James, and they need to change the mindset, refocus in this third period if they want to get back in this game. And it's going to start with puck retrieval, having some urgency around it to be able to get it and hold on to it. I mean, they haven't had any possession time. Oh, the poke check. What a read by the goaltender. Scooped up along the wall by Stetcher. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Quick pass to Schmaltz. Shot! And he gets just enough to keep it out. The goaltenders are the last line of defense for a reason. This time, he bails his team out. Arizona's put a lot of shots on net here, and they lead it as a result early in this third period. Anaheim's got possession here in their own end. Quick pass across to Strom. to the paint, and he elects to explore his options. Taken along the wall by Vetrano. Grabs it and rips it! Oh, a clutch save! Knocks the puck loose. Great reach with the poke check. Ingram's gonna hang on for a whistle. We're still in the early stages of this period. Arizona's ahead, 1-0. And they win the draw on their own end. Grabs the puck. Picked up along the boards by Bugstad. Moves it quickly over to Kraus. The Coyotes carry it along the wall. Quick shot! Oh, how did he get a piece of that to make the save? What a 
fantastic save from a high danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Jersey's moving the puck through his own zone. On the attack along the boards. Takes a shot. Too many bodies in the way. Puck grabbed by Kraus. Oh, and he just gets a piece of it to keep it out. There's the whistle as the puck goes out of play. Nearing the midway mark of the period. We got a 1-0 game to this point. Anaheim's won the defensive zone draw. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Arizona's got the puck along the boards. Kirk Cody's going to play it against the half wall. Fantastic save! Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high danger area. Arizona's been on a roll all night long and they continue to lead in the third. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Dumps it in. Arizona's got the puck. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Here's a short pass to Jersey. And that's denied by Gibson. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Carponi. Anaheim's got a hold of it along the wall. The Ducks have it now. Through center. Gets the puck in deep. Arizona's got the puck along the wall. Jersey's stick handling in his own zone. The Coyotes' top line is coming onto the ice. They've been so effective. Their chemistry is unbelievable. They have a ton of motion and they're real tough to defend. Gibson's got the puck and he's gonna slow things down. Well, he's slowing things down because his team has been under siege, James. It's the third period, it's a tight game, and he elects to get the whistle. I like this decision, it's the right one. Now everyone can get a rest and coach can get the right personnel out there. Arizona's got the puck inside the offensive zone. Right up the gut, here they go. Stoppage and play offside the call. Past the halfway mark of this period, the Coyotes have taken a 1-0 lead. Arizona's won the draw in the neutral zone. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Takes the hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Fires it! Oh, what a stop with the blocker by Gibson. Passes it over to Kalorn. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. Sometimes when you lose the puck, it's a product of trying to do too much. Sometimes keeping it simple is more effective. Anaheim's got possession of the puck. The Ducks will play it in their own end. Quick feed to Terry. Play whistle dead offside the call. Here in the late goings of the period, 1-0 is where we sit at this point. And they take control of the puck here in the neutral zone. Arizona's got possession at center. Takes a hit, but still hangs on to the puck. Michelli's got it in the defensive end. Petrano's hauled down, penalty on the way. Time for the officials to hand out the judgment. Well, everyone has a job and a role to do, and guess what? It's about PK execution right now. They have the one goal lead, now they're protecting it. They move the puck out of harm's way. 
Anaheim's got a hold of the puck now. Across the line. Along the half wall with the puck. Unloads from the blue line. And stops that big bomb. Rips it. Gets in the lane with the body. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Arizona's got a hold of the puck. And they send it down the ice. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Gets it out of his own end. Anaheim's got a hold of it against the wall. Strom's pick. through center. Cutting to the slot. Oh, what a stop on the play. Gets all of it with the paddle. Well, the shooter's in a coveted spot on the ice, right in the middle of it, with a good look, and he makes an incredible save by getting square to the puck and turning it aside. They've got the extra attacker out here for the face-off. Well, they'll be looking for a quick win and advance that puck right to the net. McTavish has won the face-off, and now let's see what they can do. Playing big in the moment there. Extra attacker on the ice. Big face off here coming up. Bugstads won the face off. Valamaki's taking it from his own end. And he loses control of the puck. The Ducks gain possession. Misses! Anaheim's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Across the line from center. Here's a chance in front! And that's intercepted! There's the final horn, and here we go! And the cherry on the top between the pipes, he picks up his first shutout of the season in that W. He doesn't get any better than that, the shutout. And look at that, everyone's giving him stick taps and fist bumps. Some block shots at the end of the game, you know how badly the defenders wanted it for him as well. Well, on behalf of Cheryl Pounder, my broadcast partner, my name is James Sabalski. Thank you so much for joining us. A fun night of hockey tonight, and we look forward to bringing you more action soon. See ya.